Hi, Tim Sales here. In this series of videos, I'm talking about how to get your spouse or significant other on board your network marketing business. And um, this video, I'm going to be talking about Laura's journey and transitions and that patience is a virtue. All right. So uh, in the in the last video, what we talked about is that Laura had gone through a couple of transitions. Right. And so what I want to do in this one and is to give you the all like the whole transition. All right. Because I was able to go back uh, like a long time in pictures and I was able to to resurrect that experience and, and th those transitions and kind of earmark them time wise. And so uh, so I want to walk you through that. And then um, and then also I'm going to just tell you about the advantage that we had. All right. So uh, so there's one other thing that I had thought of. All right. So um, this right here was when we met. OK. And so um, this was my home. This girl right here was a friend of mine. She cut my hair and um, and she somebody had sent her a video that I had made and uh, it's called Brilliant Compensation. And and she comes in. I, I, I have my appointment. And so I come in and to, to cut my hair and and she is freaked out because she didn't know that that I was that guy. All right. And so she's like, oh, my gosh, you're like, blah, 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 blah. Right. And so we just began to talk. And each time I get my hair cut, I would like, you know, she'd ask me questions. I'd train her and stuff like that. And so then she asked me, you know, like a lot of deep, deeper and deeper questions because she had joined a network marketing business and she was really excited about it. And I wanted to help her all I could. OK, well, she invited her friend for me to do a training of me training her to train somebody else to train her to, to train this lady. And uh, and so um, and this was in Florida. So you can you can kind of see the intercoastal way that way. And uh, and what she was going to do is to have Laura make phone calls with raw leads. And uh, and so so I watched that girl sitting, she had moved over to here. There was a phone right here and I saw her pick up a phone and her hands were doing this. And she, she, she maintained, even though she was scared to a shaking level, she still stayed on purpose. All right. That was when, okay. Like, yes, she's beautiful, but that wasn't enough like that. I had already seen that can be a catastrophe. Uh, there was like this scale of, you know, the more beautiful they are, the more insane they are, you know? <laughs> and so I had experienced that scale. And so the fact that she did per push through told me a whole lot about who she was. And so that's where the attraction occurred was when I watched her do that. Okay. And so um, she was willing to push through her fears, and not a lot of people are. That's bold. That's different. Okay? So, all right. So the advantage that we had is, is that we discussed our life's vision. Okay? It, does, it doesn't happen often. And, I, and back in the series where I was talking about creating your vision, I talked about this just a little bit. It's a good idea to sit down with your significant other or spouse and just talk about these things. Find out how in alignment you are uh, or out of alignment you are and, and, and so forth. And so what I also asked was, what do you need from me? What do you want from me? I mean, I got into the weeds on this stuff. So I would ask her something like, OK, so on your birthday. What do you want? Do you want a big, big party? Do you want a surprise? Do you want roses? Do you want daisies? Do you want tulips? What do you want? Right? Like, it's not enough to do what's expected. No, I needed to know what she wanted. Right? And so I remember her saying something to where she says, you know, like, I like to be surprised. And I remember, and she says, and I never have been. And I'm like, 
my profession was surprise. <laughs> like literally in the military, my, my profession was surprise. So she got surprised. So now you get the idea that we had an advantage. And so therefore, yes, yes, we created the us. Yes, we support each other, right? And we hold each other to that, okay? Um, and then I have independent goals and she has independent goals and then we have us. But why does it work so smoothly? It works so smoothly because we created a life vision, okay? Like all the way out there. And what do you need from me? And what do I need from you? Um, and what do I want from you? And what do you want from me? Like it, that, that just makes a whole lot of sense, okay? The conversation is vital. Okay, and the other one that we did is very rare, which is um, the enemy is outside the wire. So I want you to just picture that this desk that's right here in front of me is the, uh, the safe zone in a military operation. And outside of this, there's, there's fences here and there's Constantino wire around the top and there's guards and everything else so that we get a good night's sleep so that we can go out fresh and, and do, do the things we do, okay? And so the enemy is outside the fence, right? Inside, we do not allow fighting and arguing. Outside is where the war is. And the same thing goes for, for Laura and I. All of our enemies are outside the wire. So what that means is that we are going to have challenges in life. No question. But we want those challenges outside the wire. All right, so we're going to have our challenges be in business, uh, in uh, doing the pipeline, in lead generation, in those kind of things. We're not going to be and like arguing with each other. It doesn't live here doesn't live inside the wire. We're not going to be uh, like, um, you know how some couples, you know, like they'll be like, <laughs> right? And then the waitress comes over and they're like, hi, I'd like to have two eggs, please. You know, like they just immediately change and they're nice to that person, but they're mean to the person that they love the most. Right? <laughs> so what we talk about is that's what we got to do is, is that we got to be like, treat each other with the ultra respect, all right? So, so that's the other thing that, uh, that we do. Okay, so um, I ended up, as we were talking about network marketing and how much her involvement was, and uh, I was talking about, and, um, and I know it's kind of probably hard to see this, and so maybe my videographer in the, in the post can, can pull these up, but it's, I ended up saying to her, I go, look, if you don't ever want to do business, be in network marketing or anything, it's fine. Really is. Okay. Because your top priority is the kids. And, and I play more of a support role, but I'm very involved with the kids. But, but what I have to do... <clears throat> is create the finance for the life, right? And so that's the only reason that it is that she's senior in taking care of the kids, all right? So, uh, and she is a fabulous mom, a fantastic mom. She really, really cares for them, treats them incredibly well. There comes a time, right? So these are all like younger looking pictures. And so there comes a time where there's a little bit more, right? So we started out and, you know, like she's supporting me. She's just kind of on camera showing a lifestyle, right? And here uh, she hates that video more than anything in the world because she just kind of sat there and never said anything. And uh, she didn't know whether to look at me or look at the camera and all that kind of stuff, you know, if you've ever done that, that part. Um, and so here... So this is very early on. You can see that we're puppies, right? <laughs> and, uh, and so here we had an event in Las Vegas. And so she's having fun. Uh, here we have an event where we're at a beach. And here you can see that she's just, she's kind of standing there and uh, supporting me. 
And so it's all support, and every bit of that is fantastic. Okay? Uh, we go uh, to different places, and she meets new friends. Okay? So, uh, so she meets uh, these two people and, and then these people, and she becomes great friends with them, right? Like they're always, you know, talking back and forth and stuff like that. So, um, and if, 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 you, if you experience this, you're going to love it. But when you get into high production and then you start winning incentive trips, you are going to find some of the greatest people you'll ever meet in your life because those people are beyond a lot of them, not all of them, but they are beyond. Like they, they are beyond the in the mud kind of thing that occurs when somebody can't get themselves out of the way. And so they're just a much, a, a much more fun group. And so Laura got to experience how that is. And it's just fabulous. And so just really, really, she ended up just absolutely falling in love with new friends. All right. So uh, and then incentive trips, we had a lot of them. And I mean, really, truly, like what's there not to like when your everything is paid for and you're sitting on the beach for a week, you know, like really, uh, really fun. OK, so. On the weight loss program, people began to fall in love with her just because of the weight that she was able to help them lose. All right. And so uh, she did a great job of it, served them really, really well. And then the transitions. So if you just look at it, she supports me. She gets up on a camera. I'm looking in a teleprompter in this picture. And, uh, and she had made a mistake or something like that. And she made that face. And it's just always been one of my favorite. Here she is speaking from the audience. Have you seen that where, uh, you know, the speaker will step down and they'll hand a microphone and say, you know, hey, what's been your experience or whatever. And so she's speaking from the audience. OK, these are all I want you to just notice these things, all of them as advances, because this is a jump. This is a jump. This is a jump. And then. This is the jump. She's in the Zoom talking to Italy. Here, she's on that big, huge screen, right? And so I'm having to back up to take this picture of her, right? And uh, here she is doing a, a smaller event with a couple of hundred people, crushing it, right? So, but what I want you to just notice is that does it matter how long it takes? Not at all. In other words, what is senior is your relationship. And then if the person is not blocking you, all's good. You have a goal. They have another goal. Fine. OK, then there's support, meaning they come to the events. They, they're with you. They get to experience your successes and in incentive trips and stuff like that. And then they may say a thing or two and then four or five, and then 20 and 50, okay? And then pretty soon, they're leading people because she does something I don't do, and I do something she doesn't do. And each one of those, the way it's said, just because, just like the, the, the in fact, this one, just Courtney was able to say something that I could never say. And I am so happy that she said it, okay? Because it caused my wife to now see why. Because my wife felt as though that the only people who could succeed had a great story. This, I had it rough and then I succeeded. But my wife learned, oh, wow, you need a business just to, write off, just to help write off taxes. And so now she didn't need a story. Just like that. Boom. Okay. So what are those transitions? I invite her to come to meetings, conventions, events. Incentive trips, okay? So this is kind of your to-do list if you've got a long journey on it or a short journey. I would ask her, what sounds better in creating presentations, right? So when I'm creating this stuff that you see me doing and I'm creating presentations for sales funnels and I'm creating presentations for my business, then I'm always creating presentations. And so I, say, I just go to my wife and say, hey, what do you think? How's this sound to you, right? And so I'm getting her advice. These are the things that I involve her because I like her opinion on stuff. 
She meets people who are fun and becomes friends. She finds products in the company she really loves, gets customers. She comes on stage with me. She's asked by the company to be, you know, like they'll call me and they'll ask me and I say, call her, ask her. I'm not going to ask her. So then they call her and ask her to be on a video. And sometimes it's with me and, and, and without me. And then she goes on stage. So those right there were the transitions along the way that, and that you just got to see who she is now. Okay, so she would not have been standing here in front of a camera before. Okay, so all of those transitions, all of that confidence that needed to be built, all of that that I have something valuable to say, all of that stuff built up over time. And when you're first starting and you're wanting support or you're wanting your business partner or we want wanting your spouse as a business partner or your significant other, a lot of times you don't see this, but I thought that the most important thing that you could ever see is even me wasn't able to convince her to do it right away. Okay, so if it's a long journey, let it be a long journey. Okay, that's the simplicity of it. All right, so what's been your experience with a spouse learning it from another? All right, so it's very similar to the last one, but this one has all of those transitions. And so I want you to tell me a little bit about those transitions that you've experienced. Was it instant or was it, did you have to do things or has it just never happened yet? Okay, and you're all right with that. All right, so, um, and also is patience a virtue? Oh, it is. It really, really is. Like, share, subscribe if you haven't already. I appreciate all of your support that you do for me. Okay, so in the same way that we have talked about this in, uh, in, in Laura's journey, you guys have supported, all right? Some of you support and just by watching it. And some of you support by making comments. And some of you support by subscribing. And some of you support and want more. And you do the, uh, the channel, the Telegram group. And so that you can ask questions and see other people's questions and how I answer them and so forth. And so I just want to thank you for all of your support that you have given me over the last couple of years that I've been doing this. And so really appreciate you.